The motor grader is one of ODOT's most versatile pieces of heavy equipment, used for everything from blade patching and snow plowing to crowning and leveling. This video covers the basic operations for the Caterpillar 120 M2. If your motor grader is different, then refer to your grader's manual. When entering the cab, always use three points of contact. That's one hand and two feet, or one foot and two hands at an access point or handhold. Once inside, make sure that you put on your seatbelt before any operation actions are performed. To start, turn the key to the halfway mark and check the gauges on the dashboard. Once the system checks itself, the gauges will return to the starting position. Now turn the key to the full position to start the machine. The M-Series intuitive joystick control pattern allows both new and experienced operators to become productive quickly. The left joystick primarily controls the machine. Leaning left or right steers the machine. Twisting articulates the machine with an automatic return to center feature controlled by the far right yellow button. Upper left and right thumb buttons govern front wheel lean. And the index finger trigger shifts the transmission into forward, neutral, or reverse. Additional buttons provide up and down shift control. The only function on the left joystick dedicated to the blade control is the pull-push motion, which activates the left moldboard lift cylinder. The right joystick is dedicated to drawbar, circle, and moldboard control. Pull-push activates the right moldboard lift cylinder, intuitively mirroring the pull-push function on the left joystick, as well as providing the same float capability for the right lift cylinder. Leaning the joystick left or right side shifts the moldboard. Twisting rotates the circle. For example, to rotate the blade in a counterclockwise direction, simply twist the right hand joystick counterclockwise. When you release the joystick, it will return to the hold position and the blade circle will remain in the selected position. A four-way hat switch controls two functions, Rolling the switch forward and back tips the moldboard forward and rearward. Rolling it left and right shifts the drawbar to the left and right. Before maneuvering the motor grader, position the machine's blade for travel by keeping it within the width of the motor grader. As shown here, use caution when positioning the heel of the blade in front of the left tandem tire and the toe of the blade behind the right front tire as damage could occur if the blade were to touch the tires while turning. When working in tight or limited spaces, use the front wheel lean function to allow the machine to make tighter turns with a smaller radius. Likewise, combining the wheel lean function with articulation will allow the machine to make even tighter, sharper turns with a small radius. Again, keep an eye out for the travel position of the blade and make sure that it doesn't come into contact with the tandem's tires. Depending on where your worksite is located, you may have to ship the machine or simply drive it to your destination, also known as roading. If you do have to trailer the machine, start off by chalking the trailer wheels. When the machine is positioned, lower all attachments to the trailer bed for added stability. Move the transmission control switch to neutral. Engage the parking brake and stop the engine. Turn the battery disconnect switch to the off position and remove the disconnect switch key. Fasten each corner of the machine to the trailer with a chain and ratchet load binder. ODOT no longer uses crossover X tightening. Do not place chains or cables over or against hydraulic lines or hoses to avoid machine damage. Connect the frame lock link and the wheel lean locking bolt. These will hold the front and rear frame rigid and hold the front wheels in their upright position. Lastly, and before any grading is performed, be sure the utility services in the area have been notified and that the job site is marked for possible underground lines or structures. This is extremely important. Grading through a gas or electrical pipeline could be fatal.